I might be a barking blueberry. What happens if you lose your pen? You have no pen. Which means no notes taken. And no notes means no study. And no studying equals fail. And fail means no diploma. And no diploma means no work. No work means no money. No money, no food. No food, and you'll get skinny. And skinny equals ugly. But you're already ugly. Wait, what? And ugly means no love. No love means no marriage. You were never going to get married in the first place. Siri, stop! But no marriage means no children. And no children leaves you all alone. Depression. Depression. Sickness. And then sickness leads to death. Correct. Do not lose your pen today. Kids around the world between the ages of 10 to 15 have been talking about a VR game called Gorilla Tag. They say that they remember playing it on their MetaQuest 2 headsets and playing what are called mini games with their friends. But the thing is, this game has never existed. If you try to search up Gorilla Tag on Google or Wikipedia, nothing shows up. So the question we are all asking today in the newsroom is, why are all of these people talking about the game even though it has never existed? Parents around the world have also remembered their children talking about this game and wanting to buy the in-game currency known as Shiny Rocks. If you know any children in your family talk about Gorilla Tag, please call your local therapist or mental hospital to get them to treatment immediately. Going in the wind as a Do you want to play mini games? Divides them apart. Build a path to be together. And uh, I forget the next couple of lines, uh, but then it goes Secret Tunnel! Secret Tunnel! Secret, 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 secret tunnel. Hear me? Yeah. This isn't Charlie. This is his mom, Karen. Hi, Karen. 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 Sorry, I'm just, I, I can't really say words, right? Unfortunately, you did say something right to Charlie, and now he's crying about it. You wait. called him a poo-poo head last match? I, wait, I didn't call no one poo-poo head last match. You called my son, Charlie, a poo-poo head? I didn't call Charlie poo-poo head. He's crying right now. I would I like if you would apologize to Charlie. I, I never called Charlie a poo-poo head. I didn't call Charlie nothing. Is what your is mom around? Mean? I would like to speak with her about this issue. You want, you want to speak to my mommy? Yes. No. So you're just going to keep harassing my child? I'm not harassing no one. You want to know why? Because I didn't call Charlie bad word. We don't use the I... P word in my house. Really? If you, you ever use... come for my child again, yeah. I will sue you. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. I mean, do you know who I am? The person that's been harassing my child, yes. I never harass anybody because I'm nice boy. I'm not going to call someone a poo-poo head. Why don't I just lose this? You know what I'm going to do? What? I am going to go to Walmart, I'm going to pour water on the floor, and I'm going to see there's no wet floor sign. I'm then going to run across the water as fast as I can and trip over it and get hurt. I'm going to scream the loudest scream I've ever heard. And then, I'm going to sue the heck out of them, and when I'm done, I'm going to own Walmart. So, I'll be the true master. 